Hey everyone, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to set a fixed height for your Mega Menu or Mega Tooltip using the Divi Mega Pro plugin. So by default, a Mega Menu or Mega Tooltip built with Divi Mega Pro, uh, the height is adapted by the content within the Mega area. So for example, here, I added a, I have a full width Mega Menu and I said, or 100% width, and I added some content, some uh, FAQ, frequently asked questions um, in a text module, and then I added a accordion module here, and you can see the height is set by whatever is in here. So, and then as when I open the toggle, the mega menu expands as well. And so uh, there might be cases though that you do not want the mega menu to automatically adapt to the height of the content and you wanna set a fixed height. And so you can do that easily within settings. So navigate to the Mega Menu you wanna edit and scroll down to the Mega Pro Display Settings. And you can see here we have the Mega Pro Width set to 100% and then the Mega Pro Fixed Height is empty by default. And when it's empty, it'll adapt to the height of the content within. But I'm gonna go ahead and just set this to, let's try 600 pixels and see what this looks like. As soon as that updates here, I'm going to refresh the front end of the site. And you can see here, rather than being contains the entire content, it's fixed at 600 pixels. And of course, I can adjust that so I have it be you know just under uh, this top portion here. You can see I can scroll down when I open this, it doesn't automatically expand the height. It stays the same 600 pixels, but then I scroll inside. So let's try moving that down to more like 500 pixels and see what that looks like. Refresh this. That's a little better. It shows that there's more content underneath and then you can scroll, open the toggle and scroll through. So that is how to set a fixed height within Divi Mega Pro. And so this will be the same whether you wanna set a fixed height for a mega menu or a mega tooltip. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.